Welcome to our beautiful garden. We are starting a journey into the world of African marigolds. In this video, I will show you how to collect seeds from these flowers so you can grow them again next year. First, let's talk about timing. The best time to gather marigold seeds is when the flower heads have turned brown and shriveled up. This means the seeds inside are fully grown and ready to be harvested. By collecting the seeds at this peak time, you will be able to grow a thriving garden in the future. When collecting marigold seeds, always look for completely dried seed heads. These are the flower heads that have fully matured and dried out, signaling that the seeds inside are ready for harvesting. Completely dried seed heads will be brown, crisp, and easily detached from the plant. They may even start to open up on their own, revealing the dark seeds inside. Using clean scissors, clip off the dried flower heads carefully. This step is crucial for a successful seed collection process. To do this, position your scissors just above the base of the flower head, making a clean cut. This will help you avoid damaging the stem and ensure that you can easily handle the flower head without losing any seeds. It's important to handle the flower heads gently to avoid damaging the seeds inside. The seeds are nestled within the dried calyx, and if you squeeze or crush the flower head too hard, you might inadvertently break them open or scatter them, making it difficult to collect them later. Patience is key when collecting African marigold seeds. Taking your time will yield better results and ensure that you gather as many seeds as possible. By being methodical and careful in your approach, you can maximize your seed collection and set yourself up for success in your gardening endeavors. Remember, a little extra care and attention now will pay off in the long run when you have a bountiful harvest of marigold seeds to sow in your garden. African marigolds are known for their prolific blooming, producing a wealth of colorful flowers throughout the growing season. This abundance not only beautifies your garden but also provides a wonderful opportunity for seed collection. The satisfaction of collecting your own garden flowers for future planting is truly rewarding. There's something special about nurturing a plant from seed to bloom and then being able to harvest those seeds to continue the cycle. It connects you to the natural world and gives you a sense of accomplishment. By collecting seeds from your marigolds, you can save some for yourself, ensuring that your garden will flourish with these vibrant flowers year after year. But the joy doesn't stop there. You can also share the bounty with friends and family. Imagine the delight of gifting your friends packets of marigold seeds. Not only are you sharing the beauty of your garden, but you're also sharing a piece of your gardening journey with them. It's a thoughtful gesture that encourages others to grow their own flowers, creating a ripple effect of gardening joy. Once you have collected your African marigold dried seed heads, you have two options for storing them for later planting in the next gardening season. Option 1. Simply store the whole of the dried flowers in a glass jar until you are ready to plant them. This method is preferred by many gardeners as it requires less preparation and ensures that the seeds remain intact and undamaged. Option 2. Gently rub the marigold seed heads to release the seeds. This method allows you to store just the seeds themselves, which can be more space efficient and easier to handle when it comes time to plant. Spread the seeds out on a clean paper towel and let them air dry for about a week. This helps prevent mold and ensures they are fully dried before storage. It's important to allow the seeds to dry completely, as any residual moisture can lead to mold growth or reduced viability. Once dried, store your seeds in an airtight container or a paper envelope labeled with the date and type of marigold. Thank you for joining us today. By collecting and storing your African marigold seeds, you're not only saving money but also ensuring that your garden continues to thrive. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your gardening experiences in the comments below.